What is up guys and welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're gonna do, as you can see from the title, the no ERS challenge. So uh, we're gonna be jumping online. I, I thought about doing this in single player, but I just thought like it's not gonna be as fun. I feel like uh, if we do it online, it's gonna be a lot more variable, shall we say. So we're gonna jump online. We're gonna do some like three lap races, I would say. Um, and yeah, the challenge is to do no ERS. So, I think from like no ERS to max deployments, I think you lose at least a second, maybe a second and a half. So, it's going to be awfully tough. Um, but I think in terms of like race length, I'm going to I'm gonna set myself a target of trying to win a race in five races. If I can't do that, then that's challenge failed. I think if I can get a podium, that'll be a pretty good effort as well, but... We'll have to wait and see. Um, three lap races. Uh, the track selection, I think, is actually going to be random. So I'm going to see if I can just flick through. Yeah, I'm just going to do this. I'm going to close my eyes. Even though you don't know what's happening at the moment. I'm going to close my eyes and I'm going to let go now. That's the first track, China. Brilliant. Alright, so we're going to fill the lobby up. We're going to get going and uh, we're going to get started. Uh, before we do so, though, follow me on Twitter. We just hit 50,000 followers on Twitter. So thank you guys so much for that. Um, if you want to get involved in some of my lobbies in the future, then Twitter is the way to go. I just tweeted out. So, yeah, if you want to get involved, that's how you find me. But anyway, without further ado, let's get into it. The Chinese Grand Prix with no ERS. Yo! 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 Is he, is he, is he, is he maybe recording or something? Oh, oh I think imagine. he's recording. We're going to be in this Yo! video, guys. I'm going to be... <laughs> For fuck's sake. Oh, you know, what? <laughs> Alright, if you're watching this video, I, I, I can't talk because I'm doing the commentary and that would be incredibly rude to talk as if I'm commentating in everyone else's ear while they're trying to race. So, here we go for the Chinese Grand Prix. Um, I've actually turned setups off uh, so that we can have more of a fair representation. I want to see how much time I can genuinely lose without ERS. But, I don't know, if I get lucky, if there's lots of crashes... Uh, damage is off, by the way, so even if you do get tangled up in a crash, it's so easy for you to catch back up again. It's going to be interesting. Oh my goodness, I didn't mute people. Okay, I'm going to start a party. Because, you know, it's hard enough when you're talking, when Jeff is talking, it's, it's very hard to concentrate, let alone when lots of other people are talking as well at the same time. But anyway, here we are for the Chinese Grand Prix, as you can see, stock setup. Uh, if you're new to my videos, I run with no assists, so that is not an issue. We are starting in P5. Only about 10 people in the lobby, but as the races go on, more people are going to join, so it's going to be more difficult from the outset. But here we go. Um, let's change it straight away from hot lap to nothing. Let's move the brake bias, and away we go. No ERS challenge on F1 2018. I haven't seen anyone else do this before, so this should be unique and interesting, hopefully, in the Term 1. Everyone's keeping it relatively clean. There is a lot of Australians in this lobby, so that is nice. Lag may not be an issue. At least I hope. Anyway, up to Rich Revs. That was someone side by side with us there. Oh, the straight line speed is just nowhere. It's 3 1. I'm getting, <laughs> getting sandwiched there. And you can see already just how much we are under threat. With everyone else using all their ERS uh, right off the start of the race, we might actually come into this a little bit more as the race unfolds, as everyone else is a little bit more greedy with their deployment. Um, they're going to have lower batteries, and as such, they'll be running in lower modes, and it might be easier for us to come back through again. So, yeah, even with these guys, very, very difficult. Inside. P5. Let's see. This is going to be a straight up comparison now. Rich Revs. No deployment. New Zealand Ryan has joined, so I have no chance of winning a race now. I'm actually keeping up. That's actually not too bad. That's not bad at all. Maybe ERS has more of a... Oh my goodness. Maybe ERS has more of a, an effect at lower... At lower speeds, lower range. Thanks for the hit up the ass. Appreciate it. Before all the league races join, this will probably be our best chance to get a podium. I'm so slow. <laughs> I'm so slow. <laughs> uh, this is what life was like for Fernando Alonso in 2017. 
Yeah, P20 in the in the in the straights, but through the corners we are P1. This is so annoying. Chicane, get on with it. I think he's just trying to battle with me just for the sake of it. We can get a podium here if we if we knuckle down. Oh, <laughs> that is disgusting. <laughs> Come on, take him out. Take him out. Yes, that's that'll do. Back up. Into P4. Let's increase ERS deployment to up the pace. No, let's not. Let's not. Let's. We're fine, Jeff. We don't need the battery. All right, last lap of the Grand Prix. Now you can see the podium positions are right there. We just got to go out there and grab it. Okay, clear. Oh, <laughs> he's dead. Right, so it's P4 or P3. Let's go full send. We'll make up a lot of time. This is where we can make up so much time. If we can even get in front of him. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Get on with it. I think I might send one here at the inside. No, he goes defensive. Good work there. What is that lag? Okay. Thanks for the position. He's had a bad run through there. We're going to need that time in pocket now. Because we're going to lose so much time on this straight. We're going to move to the inside. No slipstream to be taken off me here. I think we might have this. Oh my god, the car just dies in the ass in 8th gear. That is ridiculous. Final couple of corners now. In our first race, we are going to hold on for a podium. With no ERS. At China, is a pretty powerful power track. 34.4 on the last lap. I will take that. I will definitely take that. It's going to get increasingly difficult now that more people are joining, especially some faster people, but I'll certainly take that on my first race. Alright, it's time to pick the next circuit. Uh, how do we do that? Track select. Uh, again, I'm going to close my eyes. It's uh, selecting between all the circuits. You know, I would love a Hungary or especially a Monaco. If we get Monaco, we could win for sure. I'm going to let go in three... Two, one. Yes! Oh my goodness! Thank you very much, Monaco baby. Let's do this. Let's get the W. Oh, I can't believe that. <laughs> I feel like I've just won the lottery. <laughs> you guys are going to think that's scripted. That is 100%. Oh, that's just brilliant. Oh, Warden's here too. Jesus. Right, I need pole, realistically. Master Berserk's here too. Uh, who else? Tom123, I think is pretty fast. Top Banter is decent now in this game. Oh, we've got some feisty competition, but if there's anywhere where I have the best chance, it's definitely this place. <gasps> you could not script this. You could not script this any better if you tried. Monaco. No ERS challenge, pole position, I don't know what else to say. Tell me that Ryan, Warden, Master Berserk, they're all last. Please tell me that. I would love it. I know Ryan's in a sale, but that could be him there in P4. Let's get this race underway. Clean start is vital. Okay, that's not Ryan. Good job. Right, let's do this. Good start is necessary. Uh... I'm going to change it. I forgot to change it to none, but there we go. Clean start. Has happened. Right, now make sure we crucially do not lose too much time up this straight. Concentrating so hard. Like, I want to win this race more than, like, Metal wants to win their world championship. Like, come on. Let's make this happen. Oh, the understeer there is real. Middle sector straight. I'm going to feel exactly like Ricardo here. No dive bomb was given, so thank you very much to that guy for not being a twat. Bridge mixture again. We've actually pulled a little bit of a gap in that third sector, which is what I want to see. Look at all those tire marks there. That is ridiculous. I'm not losing this guy either, to be honest, so this is uh, getting a little bit worrying. I know with the strength of the field that is in this lobby, 
we're going to be under threat very, very soon from the likes of Ryan Warden, Master Berserk. Monaco isn't as uh, OP for the wheel as it used to be. The wheel, can, the uh, controller can negotiate some of those high-speed chicanes a lot better than what they used to. Purple to the middle. So I'm not. This isn't a great lap. I need to buckle down here. What's this lap? 11.5. Has been enabled. We could probably do a 10 if we if we nail it. My goodness, this guy is still right up my gearbox. This is the last lap of the Grand Prix as well, by the way. Nice exit is required. Rich revs. No ERS. Just me and my swamp. <laughs> Played under brakes. Oh wow. I could have thrown it. That could have been it right then and there. We know how the game is with its strict corner cutting in three lap races. Could have been a penalty straight up, but final sector of the Grand Prix. This guy is still right up my chuff. We've got so lucky today. But we are going to make the absolute best out of that luck. A race win with no ERS. Thank you very much. Warden getting feisty with these guys, and he's gone. <laughs> oh my goodness, what is that crash? What is that crash? I've not seen... You know, lap one is... When all the stuff happens, not the last lap. Holy crap. Ugh. Warden went from like P4, P5 to, to eighth. He's not going to be happy about that one. That's all also going through the barriers as well. It's just absolute carnage here at this Monaco Grand Prix. If only I had damage on, that could have been catastrophic for those guys. Some people finding this circuit to be more difficult than others. Top Banter A7, you might be able to get that position. No, we won't be able to get that position. Dave. That final corner is very, very difficult to negotiate. I can only imagine how hard it is on a pad. Nitrous, last position. There we go. That is your Monaco Grand Prix. Thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel if you're new to see plenty more F1 2018 content. I'm actually going to con uh, continue recording, but I'm going to make it a separate video. We're going to go to like some of the worst tracks. We're going to go to Monza. We're going to go to Belgium. Might even go to something like Brazil as well. And uh, if you want to see me suffer, stay tuned for the second video. It's going to be lit. Until then... I'll see you next time. When the lights go down, I see hell in you. But you don't care, no, you don't care, no, you just rather want.